think if I kind of go for it a little bit on the climbs, that'll help. Hey baby, what up, physique? Just saying, I don't know how to go. How hard I should go on these climbs. I don't even know if four hours is doable for me. What you up to, bro? Ah. It's a good warm up right here. Yo, what up, Ice? How you doing, bro? Uh, June 18th. Nice, bro. Yeah, this is me starting the day. <laughs> Three, yeah, right. What a wow. What's going on, bro? How you been, man? RV. What up, bro? How you doing? How you feeling today? <laughs> Day 20, hey 20. There's no way I can sustain this for four hours, so gotta kind of chill. I don't even know. I don't even know. I almost want to ride Hudless and just kind of let my body do it. Feel good. Uh, Alan. Alan Lowe, redeemed Route Recon, and he picked Uber Pretzel, so I'm doing Uber Pretzel. I was supposed to go on an outdoor ride today, but <clears throat> things worked out differently. And now I'll be going and doing a, a big climbing outdoor ride on Memorial Day. So that's kind of cool. Do something big like that for my boys. <laughs> yeah, too far for me, too. <laughs> yeah. What have I got myself into?
Yeah, that's true. That's true. So I looked up, uh, like top 10 times are like 3.30 ish all time. Yeah, join on me, bro. Just know that on climbs, I'm going to kind of push it a little bit. But I'm going to be kind of chilling on the downs for sure. <laughs> Just get in a ride, man. Get in a good ride. Come hang on. I'm just trying to get through this climb. Mm -hmm. Yo, what up? Saint Hafa. What's up, man? How you doing, bro? Yeah, we're we're okay, I guess. No, I refunded the RV. I got about a thousand meters up. So like two thirds of the way. <laughs> nah, it was five it was five PM. My little girl. But hey, I did two thirds of it for free. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. The the Wow Peter way. Or redeem like right at the end. I just thought, had I known I wasn't going to do that big ass climbing ride today, I probably would have been able to do the whole thing. <laughs> I'm down. I'm down, Aggie. How you doing, bro? I actually have a pair of socks that says do epic shit. Dude, uh, clickbait racing. Caleb Carl is like top five all time on this route. It's crazy. Go army. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah, yep. <laughs> That's awesome. They're, uh, shit. Defeats sock company or whatever. I think it's defeats. What up, Jimmy? How you doing, bro? Yo, saying high five. Welcome, man. Appreciate you coming by. <laughs> I don't know about that. This is a big ride. I mean, granted, like Heist said, it's not as big indoors as it would be outdoors. Ooh, that's ships at the end of this month. Texas. I get this real life kit. <laughs> With a propeller? No. It was just your standard mid-grade butt plug. No propeller, though. So it's obviously not a propeller, right? That's like for the ass crack to keep it in the... I don't know. To let it not get sucked up? <laughs> nah. My first time getting that badge, Jimmy. Bro, 
probably coming out way too hard. But it does start with fucking climb. Epic, so. And radio tower, it's not like you can't. <laughs> right? I'm pretty sure that's what it's for, Tim. <laughs> what up, Timmy? Yeah, with the bling jewel, do you see the ruby? <laughs> oh, God. Have you guys watched Ted Lasso? The show? Oh, such a good show. If you haven't, check it out. Yeah, it's like 8,000 feet of climbing or something. 7,700 or something. I don't even know what that is. 2,200 meters, 2,300 meters. Well, that's my flash drive. Don't look at it. Unless you, you want to see TV. Big D. That's my wallet! You have oh. my wallet. And watch your fingers, booty hole man! Ah, uh, hold up, Marine. Fucking Allen, man. The fun police. <laughs> oh. What's up, you mofo? What you doing? You working? Hardly working? <laughs> I resemble that remark. <laughs> Had a, uh, a vet at the VA that would always say that. He's a good guy. Uh oh. I was gonna go swimming. But I woke up, I slept in. No kid today. So I am on the climbing bike. Yeah, I'm gonna go, uh, I'm gonna definitely do outdoor on Sunday. Maybe I can get away with it tomorrow, but I don't know how tired I'm gonna be from this. Gotta see how the grunt's feeling. Hey, he said it's pretty good, actually. style stroke oh kitten what up bro yo kitten thank you so much for the uh for the socks bro that's so awesome man thank you i never win anything and the only reason i guessed that was because i was in the 173rd and i knew you were going to get way higher than 173 watts so i was like 273 Seems like a reasonable number then.
<laughs> Damn, shots fired, shots fired. Dude, holy shit, so there's a, another one going down in October in Monterey and it's fucking ocean. Scurred. Real scurred. Texas, pew, cheers, brother, pew, for you. Pew, 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 pew. Oh, God damn it, I definitely got hit that time. Definitely got hit. Oh, Ron, what up, bro? How was your uh, sub seven ride? <laughs> Paris 2024 Holy fuck Wife would be down with that I'll start putting that in my wife's head for sure. I ain't never been to Paris before. And I'd love to go back to like Normandy. Not so hammered and hung over. Like actually get to see shit. I was there for the 65th anniversary of D-Day. But I was just basically blackout drunk or hung over the whole time. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I'm gonna be alive as fuck on the try. <laughs> What's up, RV? Hope you had a good day of work, bro. So I was actually supposed to be in charge of the medics on the drop zone when the uh, paratroopers from all over the world jumped in in memoriam of D-Day. And I got so drunk the night before on their like moonshine, basically, Fr France's moonshine, that I couldn't even be woken up. Nice, got paid, there you go. I'm already sweating like fucking crazy. Marine, you ever swam in the ocean? You ever done one in the ocean? No, you haven't, huh? Dude, the one in Monterey in October is, is in the ocean. Oh, God, I'm so scared, bro. It's like a whole other thing. It's like a whole other thing, man. I don't know, bro. Oh, oh I drink a bunch of absinthe. I got kicked out of an absinthe bar because I was drinking too much. I drink beyond the bar's limit. I kept ordering these, like, one-shot drinks, basically. They're super strong. They had like seven of them on the menu. I was like, I'm going to get all seven of them. They didn't realize that I was the only one drinking these drinks until I was getting like my sixth shot or something. And they kicked my ass out. Needless to say, I don't remember much after that absinthe bar. That was in Germany. So like, you know, the shit wasn't like bullshit. Now, I never hallucinated from it, and me and my buddy drank half a bottle to the dome each uh, shit that he ordered from overseas. Yeah, it never worked. Yeah. Same, we just got super fucking drunk. <laughs> Hammered. I mean, maybe if it's done in like very perfect doses, you know? I don't know.
Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> pretty much, dude. We were getting shit faced. I definitely wet the bed that night. I remember that actually. My buddy, when we were in Fort Bragg, ordered like three different bottles from Europe that had wormwood in it and shit. And we drank a full bottle one night. Yeah, yeah, it is the wormwood. We drank a full bottle, man. And just got hammered drunk. And I pissed the fuck out of that bed. And we were in like a, I don't know, kind of like an Airbnb now, I guess. This was back in like 2005. Um, it was in like Wilmington Beach, North Carolina. We were staying. Now I never did triple C either. I had buddies in the barracks that were doing that shit. I never got into it. I never tried it. I don't know. If I was going to do a hallucinogen, I wanted it to be either acid, mushrooms, or I guess wormwood. I wasn't trying to take fucking cough syrup or anything. Yeah, no. Syrup. Yeah, I had buddies. Dude, they'd be tripping the fuck out in the barracks. Yeah, they were weird as fuck. Yeah, he's in there. Uh, lukewarm. Just do at lukewarm. Oh, God. I've never done Molly. Done a shit ton of Xanax. I think I've told my Xanax bar stories. Ugh. Oh, Jesus, what's that? Yeah, lukewarm kitten. Crazy. Off the of fucking scissor. That's wild. Now, I won't even like, I don't know. Me and the wife have talked about doing Molly together. If anything, I would like microdose mushrooms, which I've done a couple times. Recently, not recently, but somewhat recently. Selling marijuana. Basically, Texas. Basically, bro. It is fucking craziness, I'm telling you. Just getting shit faced. Trying to bang any of the chicks in the barracks. Uh and just doing dumb shit, man. Oh yeah. yeah the ugliest chicks were getting nailed all the time. No standards. Yeah, it's craziness. <laughs> I got out of, well, I got into the army to get away from drinking every day and blackout drinking every weekend and just doing stupid shit. And it was just more of that and worse. Cause you gotta think, they encourage it, man. Every military function has alcohol involved. The, the PX is where you go get the alcohol is open 24 seven. It's tax free. So it's cheaper, man. I think dude, like somebody Google military annual alcohol spending or something it's fucking ridiculous how much money is spent on booze in the military it's astounding yep yep and then go fucking run in the morning <laughs> sweat it all out but what it was is work hard play hard man we'd bust our ass and then go fucking Party our asses off. Oh, yeah. Bankers? Oh, yeah, they're partying. Everybody is, man. Dude, like, they would do health and welfare checks. And the riggers, the fucking guys rigging our parachutes, would just try and take off in their cars 
They were all getting busted, like, doing coke and shit. The medics, like, I think the dumbest shit any of the medics were doing was, uh, that Sazerp shit. Other than that, it was just drinking a shit ton. And shooting up each other with IVs all drunk as fuck. Bleeding all over the place. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, me either, yeah. I drank for... shit. A good, like, six years hardcore, man. Every day drinking, like, half a bottle of rum or Jameson. And then the weekend just fucking going for it. Pissing my pants at night and shit. I don't know how the fuck my wife is still with me. She dealt with that shit for, like, the first four years. Me just be doing embarrassing dumb shit. I was just trying to have fun. That's the guy I am when I get shit faced. I just want to have fun. There are no limits. <laughs> we are gonna fucking drink the most you've ever drank. Yeah, yeah, nice. Yeah, cycling's what got me cleaned up, and luckily that was before my daughter came. Oh yeah, I was the uh, I was the urinalysis guy. I was the one administering the piss test. It was all very random. But I got away with some crazy shit, man. When we were in Afghanistan. Uh, I had some morphine that was off the books and I tried to go to our pharmacy tech browning and try and turn it in. It's like, bro, I don't have that on record. I can't take that because then it, it's all fucked up. I don't know. And so it was just the way we got pushed out when we first got to Afghanistan. They pushed like four of us out to go uh, be medics in the corn golf. And uh, they pushed us out so quick that they just handed us stuff to put in our aid bag, like the actual, like, trauma medicine shit, you know, fentanyl lollipops and fucking morphine auto injectors. And uh, so I came back from there and I tried to turn that shit in. He's like, no, nah, bro, I can't take it. I was like, well, what am I supposed to do with it? He's like, I don't know. So I was like, okay, don't fucking tell me that. So I went in to where my little bee hut was and fucking slid my blanket closed. And I sat there and shot that shit up. Got all fucked up. Spent no lollipop hanging in my mouth. Went and threw up because I was overdosing. And then just sat there itching myself and shit. And then I kind of got... into it a little bit because <laughs> I had more yeah I was shooting the shit up in Afghanistan man I went on R&R &R, and uh, so I came back my my squad leader who was E6 he was like brigade NCO of the year he was fucking squared away well, me and him started doing it kind of together with the shit that I had left. And then he was like stealing shit, I guess. When I came back from R&R, &R, he was fucking specialist in E4 from E6 to E4. He got demoted. He ended up getting demoted all the way down to E1 for getting busted for that shit. And I snuck through miraculously. I don't know. But then uh, one night, my buddy had some that were off the books, so we did it, shot some up, and then the next morning, we were off that night. 
Uh, we rotated like 12 hour shifts with the other platoon. And uh, we had a fucking 100% urinalysis that, that day when we came back. Everybody. Me and my buddy and like two other dudes that had kind of like messed with fentanyl lollipops. Uh, scared as fuck. I was an E5, I was a sergeant at the time. I was so fucking scared. And then uh, they sent me away for like two months to replace a couple medics that were going on R&R. &R. And uh, I was just expecting to come back, like have all this paperwork to sign to get demoted and shit. And... No, nothing ever happened. They don't test every this bottle. They just test like a couple of them and just go off of that. So luckily mine wasn't one of the ones that was tested. But like when we were in the court golf and we were smoking hash. Hash and a uh, canned air. <laughs> we need bodies, yeah. And see, what's tough is, like, all of this was after I spent, like, six months during the fighting season in the Korngal, like, going through some crazy shit, so it was all, like, the perfect escape from all of that. When I got back to my unit, it was at a much safer base, Jalalabad. <clears throat> I was losing my mind there. I was so used to, like, being woken up to gunfire. And that we were never being shot out here. But there was a range right down the way, and so I'd hear that gunfire and fucking freak out. Couldn't stand the quiet. The, the, the idea that all these people have no idea what's going on outside the wire. It was crazy. Yeah, I mean, they'll kick you the fuck out. He got kicked out. That dude was going to do 20 years. He was going to be a fucking sergeant major one day. But they kicked his ass out. I think he had to spend a little time in the uh, military prison, too. <laughs> yeah, I bet. Probably lots of big rocks waiting to be turned into little rocks. Never ending supply of big rocks. Man, one of the uh, punishments I had to do one time. Okay, wait, I want to swap bikes. Ah, shit. Shit. Worst bike swap ever. There we go. No, I'm still like a 330, bro. The, uh, the try training is not going to allow me to get to a 340 most likely. Maybe. PTTs will help. I just didn't do them yesterday because I thought I was going to fucking be doing big ass climbs today. Haha, <laughs> John, I've already done it, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I think I'm in the wrong bike. I'm on my climbing setup. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, oh no, I thought it was going to hit it. I for sure thought I was going to hit it. <laughs> Damn it. Is bringing downhill races. Oh, they're going to bring downhill races. Oh, crazy. Crazy. It's going to be wild. I need, I need to get a uh, run in. I might do a run after this ride. Depending on how we're feeling. I don't even know where this goes after this. <laughs> yeah. Jungle? Oh, great. Great. Another bike swap. Go gravel. Yeah, I think it is. I think I do jungle. Like, I go around it, come back up, do like volcano and shit. Maybe. And then, uh, do hilly or something or Zwift and then go back down jungle and finish up with the Alp. I think something like that. Hopefully this TT bike helps us. I gotta change the uh, bike setup on this. I have it set up for climbing. I don't need that anymore until... Uh, All right, so we switched to an 11.34. I could do like 11.30, but I feel like my knees are on the edge right now. Maybe not so much my knees, but I think it's my groin is in my head. My groin is in my head. That'd be weird. guys I mean Texas when's the last time you swam because LePage has definitely got that on you right now if you haven't been swimming at all because our boy hats he's been getting some out you know open water practice too race practice I'm gonna try and go open water swimming on Sunday morning if I can. Should be able to.
eight months ago. Yeah, it's been a while, dude. That Uber? Or Road to Sky. Nice. Oh, oh, gotcha, yeah, yeah. Oh, Road to Ruins. Oh, nice. Come on, man. Isn't there a fucking downhill right here? Yeah, the page is getting strong, guys. Don't, don't, uh, don't turn your back on him. All right, a little bit of a downhill right here. I'm gonna switch bikes. Oh, what? Come on. Oh, come on, damn it. Damn it. Great, jungle time, yay. Hey, Wow's favorite route. Still gotta do that this year. 25 jungle last, Jesus, that's gonna suck. How many kilometers did that ended up being, Wow? Oh, nice, Texas. <laughs> Jesus. It's a big ride. Probably about 125 miles or something. Nice, how was the trip? Uh-uh. 
No. I saw a picture from somewhere in Europe, man, that had like 15 foot tall walls of snow along the, one of these roads. <laughs> Might have even been higher than 15 feet, man. It was fucking high. Oh, I thought you were going to say like six feet or something, bro. I, mean, I guess it is May. What up, Hagen? Yo, Beast, it's always funny listening to you in the TTTs, bro. I know, I know, I know, Marie. That just registered. So yeah, that is, that is kind of crazy. How you feeling after titties last night, Hagen? That was a beast ride from you guys. <laughs> yeah. Man, is this the fucking downhill yet? I mean, I'm not doing 28 miles, bro. I already told you that. Wait, hold on. I'll run up it. I'm not running down it. Down is going to fucking suck. Yo, Team Italy. Buongiorno. Thanks for the follow, guys. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, I'm not doing that shit, uh-uh. Yeah, no. No, Texas. Yeah, it's the Grand fucking Canyon. Yeah, no thanks. Not doing it. Uh-uh. Yo, you too, Team Medley. Have a great day, man. Thanks for following, man. Appreciate you guys. <sighs> Gotta make sure I, uh... Give you guys a follow back. Why am I working so hard on the downhill? And it's like barely a downhill. There was somebody to draft with to uh, use this draft boost. Actually get something out of it. So what's this route? 130 kilometers. And we've done 30 of that in an hour. I have to push a little bit, huh? That's true. true. Fuck the jungle. Damn it! Horrible. Help to finish, yep. Yeah, jungle sucks big time. Uh, I'm not too sure. Let's see. I'm going to say, let me guess, eight hours. I 
Here we go. Eight and a half hours. Wow, that's close. 614 miles. Yeah, it's a trek. Oh, yeah. Yo, Narex. What's going on, man? Yo, beast. Let's, uh... I think Team Italy streams. Yeah, nice. <laughs> That'd be fun racing with these guys. <laughs> Not knowing Italian. <laughs> Sounds, you know, it's like the racer's language, you know? I feel like it's the cyclist language. Where does cycling start? Anybody know? Anybody know where riding a bike started? Had to have been Europe, right? Amsterdam, huh? You think so? I'm gonna say Italy or, you know, of course, like I wanna say France, because of the Tour de France, but Germany, you think? Is that, I mean, is that the answer? games <laughs> uh, hell yeah team Italy hell yeah <laughs> uh, the first ver verifiable claim for a practically used bicycle belongs to German Baron Karl von Dreis a civil servant to the Grand Duke of Baden in Germany Dreis invented his Lauf machine German for running machine in 1817 that was called Dreisine. Dreisine. Or Dreisein by the press. Interesting. Oh, dude, I got so much shit going on, bro. Fuck, I don't know. I got way too many commitments. My wife is gonna start wondering where I'm getting all this money. <laughs> I mean, I'm going to kind of physique it up on my future trips to just kind of camp with my tent and my air mattress. I went and bought a battery powered pump. Dude, at that triathlon, my uh, sister-in-law had gotten us an air mattress or something at some point. Or no, no, I'm sorry. Got us a kiddie pool for a little girl and bought a, a pump. It came with it, a chargeable, rechargeable pump. So we got to the try. I go grab this rechargeable pump that I charged up all night the night before. Doesn't fucking work. Luckily, I was in my wife's Jeep. So I go grab, like, it's got a uh, one pen socket in there. I go plug that bitch in. Doesn't work. It's broken as fuck out of the box. I had to blow up a queen size air mattress with my lungs. I woke up at like two o'clock in the morning. I was touching the ground. I had to sit up and blow that shit up again with my fucking lungs. 
two o'clock in the morning. Oh my god. Horrible. Welcome to the party, pal! Oh, the Redeemer himself. The Redeemer himself. How was your ride, bro? What'd you get into just now? Yeah, we going, Alan. We doing it, bro. It's all your fault. Oh, interesting. Oh, that's very smart. I didn't even know they had those. We're going to see a sprint. Let's go, Alan. Get the fuck up and go, Alan. You're going to go. Go, baby. Oh, we missed the best part. Oh, nice. A little Zwift race, huh? What race did you do? <sighs> I know, we missed the best part, man. Somebody did not clip that. Correctly. Gotta get out of this fucking jungle. Alright, we're below 100 kilometers remaining. That's good. I like that. Back to double digits. Oh, yeah. So they get their money, bro. So they get their fucking money. Oh, Jesus. What's that? Like, this gotta be like $100. I still gotta figure out what I'm gonna do. I think I might get the clip on arrow bars or whatever, like Spoon's got. Get some cheap ass arrow helmet and get one of those arrow disc jackets or whatever and make my arrow wheel a disc wheel for like a hundred bucks. <laughs> yeah, I still gotta book my airline ticket. Fuck. I got the hotel room. Well, check this out. Grim made a great point. That's the most I can do for as little money as possible. Well, I happen to buy a whole other bike. So I feel like it just makes sense. Yeah, sure. I mean, who knows? Maybe it shades off. I mean, if I think about it, I lost to that dude by 50 seconds. Let's say I put arrow bars on, arrow helmet. One of those disc jackets. Bet you I take third overall. I can get a fucking super cheap one. It's just anything to make mine as close to you guys on TT bikes or tri bikes as possible. Yeah, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll hit you up. I'm not doing that anytime soon. That would be a a last minute thing before Texas. See how I budget my money over the next couple months. I gotta be, I gotta be broke as fuck for the next couple months, basically. I spent way too much money getting ready for that first try and then getting all these other ones and fucking goddamn cabins up in Huntington Lake on Father's Day for one. Hotel in Texas. <laughs> yeah, let's get more broke. <laughs> oh, what up, champ? 
Cyfunk. We're uh, where is it? Dallas Irving, the PTO triathlon. A bunch of us are meeting up. I don't know where you're at, but if you want to come meet up? A bunch of us will be there. Irving, yeah. Nice, Cyfunk. Looks like we're gonna be meeting up, baby. I'm gonna be there from the 15th through the 19th. I'm totally down to go for a chill ass ride before or after the triathlon. Yeah, dude, the goddamn tries are fucking cleaning me out too, bro. I'm, I'm cleaned out. Cleaned out. I'm broke as fuck for the next couple months. Goddamn. Oh, man. Yeah, I'm broke. Oh. Oh, shit. Stop. I'm on a fucking uphill. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna stay there. <laughs> See, I'd be one of the ones that moved out there and embraced Texas. That's how I am. And plus, I'm I'm red as fucking a blue ass state, so I'm as I'm as Texas as they come. I graduated high school in Texas. That makes me half Texan. I, I got part educated in Texas. <laughs> Ooh! Yeah, I lived in Fort Worth. Went to Fossil Ridge High School in Keller, Texas. Exactly. Exactly, Brian. You know the fucking deal. I bring this goddamn... Doc Spice, wherever I go. I bring my pelvic thrust wherever I go. Mashing, what up, baby? I was always a guy like when I was stationed in Germany, I really tried to use as much German as possible when I was out in the city interacting. Like I was the dude that was actually paying attention to the one week in processing <laughs> classes and shit we had to go through learning like German culture and basics of the language and shit. Yeah, I don't want to feel the ground. It's so fucking hot. I'm all beer bitter. Thank you. Yeah, totally. Totally, Brian. Totally. Like, I got my buddy who's from, like, Georgia. America's Georgia, where Jimmy Carter's from. And this dude would, like, just be hillbilly as fuck out there at the restaurant. Just, like, I don't know. I, I would get embarrassed sometimes. So I would just, like, order for him. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's Americus, Georgia. The home of Jimmy Carter and boiled nuts is what he always says.
Yeah, 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 totally, yeah. I mean, that's how I was, because I would, like, embrace it as, like, as a true German, so I would just do the informal shit all the time. <laughs> What's up, bro? <laughs> <laughs> Boiled nuts. Never had them. Pretty cool, though. Uh, last time me and this dude saw each other, he's out of the army now. Works for NASA. Last time we saw each other it was like 2012. Well, he hits me up like a couple weeks ago. And he's like, hey, what are you doing on this weekend? And I was like, oh, shit, my wife's got a wedding in Tahoe that weekend. I'm going up with her. He's like, and he's, he lives in Florida, uh, Cape Canaveral. And he's like, uh, he goes, I'm going to be in Tahoe that weekend. And he was, uh, his job sent him out there to go through some composite training. And, uh, and then he decided to go rent a hotel in, uh, or I'm sorry, get a hotel room in Tahoe. And I just happened to be in Tahoe that weekend. So I got to see one of my fucking buddies army that i hadn't seen in you know 10 years i'm sorry i guess it was like six or seven years ago we saw each other my bad but yeah that's pretty what a fucking coincidence you know pretty cool okay now where am i going i have no idea am i on the right bike i have no idea <laughs> yeah i think i think side of the road boiled nuts yeah Yeah, that kind of shit. Yeah, I never had them. Damn draft loose all fucking day. Never, Brian. This guy's going so fucking slow. Oh, interesting. I like the. I guess I like the Cajun flavor. I'm not. Okay. I, when I go to restaurants, if they got a fucking jambalaya, oh. I'm always getting a jambalaya. Cheesecake Factory has a bomb ass jambalaya. And I probably don't know a good jambalaya, so. Ooh, biscuits and gravy? Oh, God, yes, please. One of my favorite breakfasts is, uh, okay. Get two biscuits or whatever, biscuits. And you get sausage patties. I like sausage. I love it as sausage. Uh, um, sausage patties. Scrambled eggs. Smothered in motherfucking gravy. Woo! Bro. Oh. I ever see that on a menu? Every time. Getting it. Oh, yeah. Minus them onions and jalapenos. Well, maybe jalapenos, but minus them fucking onions. Get that shit out of there. You keep that garbage out of my food.
<laughs> yeah. The cheap bike. I think I got Volcano next, so I think I gotta get off this bike, yeah? Can't do this on a TT bike. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, I was looking at a used one for anything less than like two grand. I just can't fucking do that right now. Man. I don't have that kind of money. Motherfuckers ain't taking no credit cards. Yo, bro, you take credit card? Oh, yeah, I want to. I just haven't been in an area that's selling them. Oh, yeah? I didn't have them in Texas. I don't know. I'll have to get some out there, then. remember if I do Volcano first, yeah, I go to Volcano. And then, like, Tempest and all that gay I mean, I mean, all that stuff. The dumb flats. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Dang geishas and Mercury. <laughs> Get off this TT bike though. Uh... Oh, and it's gonna stick it with the fucking discs. Lowest bike swap ever. Yeah, Z. Dude, your ride was super fun to watch this morning, Z. Yeah, I bet. Hell yeah. Great way to start the day. You guys didn't see Zavarish was uh, taking his, uh, we got like a cyclocross bike on a pump BMX track and then a dirt BMX track on his way to work. Oh, nice. <laughs> Look at that guy. Look at that old guy on the pump track.
<laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh shit. How many? But then just keep an eye out for like a limit over like 50 pounds or a charge or something. Oh hell yeah. That'd be cool to watch. Volcano KOM. Okay, okay, oh, damn, I haven't seen her in a while. It's been a hot minute. We actually haven't seen any of the titty streamers recently. What up, Chemical? How you doing, man? <laughs> right, physique? <laughs> Oh, it always does, Chemical. Nice, hell yeah. Hell yeah, bro. You should just start doing RV. Just get up farther and farther each time. Once you do it a bunch, man, it's not that bad. Ah. Yeah, I see what you're saying. I, I, I know that there's a couple others that are like yourself as well that trying to build up the fitness to be able to do it in one stretch so just keep at it brother
prepare yourselves for war. Airborne. Ah. Uber pretzel, bro. The big boy. I'll take off HUD after this climb. I'll put on HUD. Yeah. Take a little bit. Got to save some energy for the Alp. Oh, the champ is one. Ah. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> hey, look at that champ. You're not overrated, bro. Oh. Oh. Yeah, they did, chemical. Yeah, a lot of people are bummed about that. Afternoon, evening on the 15th. Leaving morning, early afternoon, uh, the 19th. I mean, really, those are like my 15th and the 19th are my travel days. 16th will give me a full day before the event. 17th is the day of the event. 18th will give me a full day after the event. Kind of hang out with you guys and go on like a recovery ride or some shit. I don't know. Warm up ride, a little swim the day before or something. Those are my thoughts. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. I, I looked at the email and they're supposed to mail out at the end of this month. Should get an email, hopefully before the end of the month. We'll see. <clears throat> I'll be chilling at the pool with Marine then. Oh, God dang it. More about this. Yeah, so I would say like uh, afternoon, evening, 15th, if you're flying on the 15th. That's what I'm going to try and get in.
right now. Texas, I have no idea, bro. Uh, the downhill. And then I think I go through Tempest Fugit after this. I don't even know what I was looking at. What was I doing? Okay, cool. Yeah, 59th is perfect. But yeah, it'll be heavier on this descent right here. Let's shave off a couple seconds, a little less effort. Oh, perfect. Yeah, perfect. There you go. So that's kind of what I'm going to look at doing. All right, so if you're getting ready to book, then let me know, and then I'll book around yours. Let's kind of try and get around your same time. I book sooner, but I'll let you know. Yeah, same. I mean, I'm probably just gonna have to do fucking credit card. I should have gone for a swim today. I should have woke up a little early. Maybe do a run depending on how the legs feel after this ride. I guess try and go for a swim tomorrow, but then I was planning on doing a lake swim on Sunday morning. What's this? Cadence partner. Need one of those. I'd love one of those. Yeah, they are. Jesus. Right, there's a B one right down there. Yeah, yeah, they uh they added some mid bots. Some bots in between the original pace bots power wise, watch per kilo wise. So that's kinda nice actually. Cause like if I wouldn't if I'd get distracted and not pay attention to the pace partner, I would drop cadence. And then if I hopped in with Brevet, I would get dropped from Brevet if I wasn't paying attention. So I'm glad that they put like a bot in between like the perfect bot. 
for my like distracted rides, like hanging out with you guys, just trying to get in some spinning. So now I think we end up going through Tempest. Yeah, they do. Fuck yeah, they do. Keep forgetting that this finishes with the fucking out. Damn it. Um, I, I was supposed to go outdoors and do that four climb ride today, but my groin's been bugging me uh, since my last uh, outdoor swim on Tuesday. I should have fucking gone today, man. It's going to be 10 degrees hotter when I go next weekend. But anyway, so today was free. I still had my little girl. I spent the night at my parents last night. My wife's picking her up after work, so I have like the whole day. Look at all these bots, man. So I figured I'd get on a decent ride today, in place of the massive ride I was supposed to do originally. But at least now, like, I get a little bit of extra time to prepare for it a little bit. And uh, I heal up from this groin bugging me. I don't know how this four hour thing is gonna work. No, but. I doubt that's gonna happen. Oh, that's fucking Texas right there. <laughs> I was just hopping on his wheel. Didn't even pay attention to the name. What up, baby? See, we're just doing some zone two, zone three right now. <laughs> Drop him. I think I'm on Fugit after this. 
I can't remember shit. I don't remember where this goes. Pretty sure it does though. That's exactly it, TD. <laughs> uh. I was going to try and put in a little effort. Get it, Texas. I should get off this bike. Yo, what a beast! An Arthic, hey, hey! A little bit. Hopefully not too much longer. I think I want to get off this bike though. You want to switch to like an aero bike RV with the ride on. Thanks, bro. <sighs> Zeke, you're a sexy beast. Thanks, Timmy. Did that. Fuego flats. Yeah, so fuego, fuego, and then Alp. <laughs> I'm moving to Oslo. Hell yeah. Nice, Anarthic. Hell yeah. What kind of bike did you get? Always a good day when you get a new bike. Who's that? Is that you, Heiss? I don't think so. I think they're Heiss Von G on Zwift, too. Texas, I think I'm going to switch bikes real quick, bro. Yeah, I'm going to switch bikes. Hold on. That was a pretty good okay we'll just go there that was a pretty good swap actually happy with that swap yeah, that's what i thought there we go at least now we can draft Dude, let's catch Anquatil. Oh, they're coming the other way. Damn you! Now Texas is hammering.
Oh, this fucking ride sucks. I think that's Lady Serene. You know, come with the ride on. Thank you. That is Lady. Hey, what up, Lady? Thanks, bitch. Oh. Fucking Texas. <sighs> oh, lady. It's the Uber pretzel. <laughs> Only halfway there. Not even yet. All right. All right. Oh. Let me get that sweet Texan draft. Don't you do it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I know, it's weird. I think Twitch, like, auto clips weird shit. Just random things. <laughs> Was I on the goddamn TT bike the whole time? Can I just do that on the fucking TT bike that whole time? <laughs> Fucking boomer doc. Booming with doc. <laughs> uh, I don't even remember. Idiot. I don't even remember what that was, but I was oh super my pissed God. off at myself. <laughs> oh, what is this music? <laughs> what is this music? This is not synthwave. Here you go, Miss Harkloss. <laughs> Hooker's missing out right now. Alright, here's, here's the floss you want. Miss Hooker. Let's go. Woo! Wow, writing. Look at that. Look at that talent, though. <laughs> Look at the talent. I think, I think maybe it's underestimated how difficult that was. The balance and all? Wow, pedaling? Yeah, right? Dude, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, Kia, what's up, bro? How you doing? What you getting into today? I think you and Bike Beast are getting ready to do some crazy shit. I'm about halfway through my crazy shit today. I should really edit this redeem for like a route that doesn't take as long as four hours. <laughs> How he's doing his K for K craziness? Madman Keo. Ah. Oh. Oh. Oh, zone two and cake. Are you doing a cake out? Hmm. 
Yeah, marathon week next week. Oh shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yep, I'm on the 27th, I think. Oh, thank you, Texas. <laughs> One piece, but it's three pieces. <laughs> what are you eating like a quarter of a cake? Sliced into thirds? Oh my god. We gotta go through Titan's Grove? No! Nuh uh. Come on, man. Okay, my legs are kind of getting done for. Okay, drink more. Eat more. Oh god. That went everywhere. Ah. <laughs> oh, you're crazy. Fucking cake out. <sighs> oh, you're not doing it on now. Well, now you should. Where else are you gonna eat cake, bro? I feel like that's the only segment worthy of food while riding this zone to it oh man Oh my god, man. Every time I dream. Ah. You're going to be like right at two hours at the halfway point. Now I should definitely be on a TT bike, but arrow's good enough. Uh, yeah, always Alan, never changes.
<sighs> Kinda, not really. My legs are definitely hurting though, so maybe a little hard, yeah. <laughs> what up, Z Reed? Yeah, yeah. I can just go. I so I've created bike profiles. So I have a profile. The one I'm on right now is a uh, 1134. I have a profile that matches my uh, actual road bike with an 1130. I set up a Everesting bike that had a three by up front and it was 1140 on the back. <laughs> and then I have like a racing one set up that's like 1125 or some shit. Yeah, I'm just letting Texas do some work right now. Pull me through Tempest. Just hold him a nice steady 3.7, 3.8. Means I'm like 3.2-ish, yep. Yeah. Uh, 73 is happening in September. I think it's a 73, right? Yeah. I got another Olympic try in a month. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I tried to do it last time, but it was my first time doing a triathlon. And it was my first time using the Garmin, really. And I just fucked it all up. I even did like a couple like run throughs with it to make sure I had it down and still fucked it up. Uh. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I fucked it all up. I started my run. I started the Garmin like a mile into the run. My bike computer didn't sync up to like a couple miles into the ride. I'll do a couple more dry runs with it and see how it goes. Oh. Okay. Jet, what's happening, man? How you doing, bro? Oh.
I'm really feeling this ride right now. Ugh. <sighs> Thanks, Anarthic. Oh, nice. Outdoors? In real life? Oh, man. My legs are uh, uh, cramping. Nice. How'd you do? Is that your first crit? <laughs> yeah, down below. Ziri, bottom of the screen. A lot of blue right now. Kind of hurting. And I've got Texas in front of me. I'm kind of pull or drafting on. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah, Jet. Lakutus. Uh, what up, bro? How you doing, man? Let's get uh, old Lakutus. Uh, how you doing, bro? How was your ride? What were you doing? What are you doing? Did you race? Are you working out? I appreciate you, Texas. Thanks, brother. How long is Tempest Fugit? Oh, there it is. Sorry, never mind. Seven kilometers. All right, Lakutis, thanks, brother. Thanks for coming by, man. Thanks for the raid. Welcome, Raiders. Trying to knock out Uber Pretzel. As redeemed by Alan Lowe. Thanks, Alan. Yeah, of course he's going to pick the big one. At least he didn't pick PRL full. I should make like a stipulation. But I don't know. I just kind of figured, dude, if you're saving up that many points, it's a lot of time like watching, lurking, whatever. I can spend four hours on the bike. Uh, fucking hurting though. I got a long ways to go. Oh god. No. Oh, is he re Take that back right now. Take that out of the air. Look, I'm eating. That's when you know. No, I've never done a jet. So at least I'll get that sweet, sweet virtual badge.
Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably get to level 49 for sure. Hmm. No, not yet, man. I actually thought just now I was at level 49, about to be level 50. <sighs> Trey, what up, baby? How you doing, man? Oh, what? Road Rash? Fuck yeah. Oh, man. Who remembers that game? Oh, that game was so much fun. Oh. Enchiladas were calling. Oh, I had enchiladas last night. Oh, fuck, man. I don't even know, z -Reed. I don't even feel like I got that left. I'm hurting, bro. My legs are starting to cramp up. Got great hydration and nutrition coming into this. All right, look at my heart rate. For like 200 watts, it's 160 right now. Dude, I hate it, bro. I hate it, physique. Hate it. I don't even know how Texas did it. Texas, how'd you do this? Oh, from the phone. <coughs> from your phone, I guess you could do it. Open it swift, because I don't think the update user interface went to the phones. Thanks, Alan. I'm hurt, bro. Not lying. <laughs> yeah, I was kind of trying to do this four hour thing. Ugh. I think I might have to throw that out the window. Like, where the fuck do I go right now? too hard on our first climb.
Um... Oh man, health. Oh no, I'm just, <laughs> just winded.
<laughs> like my gas tank, kind of. So exert as my FTP at 327. So if I stay over 327, it'll start depleting. As I stay below 327, it'll recharge. It's pulling heart rate data, power data. Oh, oh my God. Yeah, man, I gotta save some for the Alp. Oh. <laughs> Bike beast. That's not the saw. No. The saw is horrible. <laughs> oh, we gotta go do fucking this KOM now. to go watch. Yeah. Saw is ridiculous. I do got to come back at it, though.
Yeah, it's ridiculous smashing. Need to go look at it. It's fucking crazy. A wow Peter creation. <laughs> yeah, yeah, just a little bit. Just a tip. Just a little tickle. you in the fucking back ah. no idea RB feel dead inside Actually, I feel dead on the in the outside. It's starting to impact how alive I feel on the inside. Try to get to the base of the Alp in 30 minutes. I don't think that's going to happen. Not at this pace. I mean, I don't think it's going to happen, Skip. <sighs> Fucking, uh, looks like it was a race or something, but Caleb Carl is on Strava with the fifth fastest overall time for the Uber Pretzel. But it looked like there was a bunch of dudes that were very close this time, so it looks like it was some type of race. Yeah, uh, yeah, I don't think it's gonna happen, bro. There's no way. There's no way I get to the base of Alp. Even if I got there in 45 minutes, it still requires a 45 minute effort up and there's no way I got that in the legs right now. I maybe have a 60 minute effort. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I can't, I don't have 40 minute out of my legs. 
I'm thinking 55 at the best. My hammies are starting to cramp. My fucking quads are cramped up. My shins, my shins are starting to cramp. Yo, what up, Dan? Thanks, bro. Yeah, I've been drinking decently, I guess, kind of. No, not really. Only my second water bottle. Yo, Dad, thanks for the follow, bro. I'll still be here, Dan. <laughs> Have a good run, bro. One seventy at like two hundred watts. Oh damn, Jet! Dude, I'm gaining weight. It fucking sucks. <laughs> More like seventy-seven kilos now. Oh man.
<laughs> I'm losing my climber's build. I lost it a while ago. Oh my god, man. They draft this guy. Well, it's going harder. Climby sprinting boy. <laughs> I'm turning into a thick boy, apparently. Oh, cream. The cream betweens. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Thank you. Or do you mean tats or tits? We've had that mistake before. <laughs> Majarky? What up, bro? Yeah, fuck that. Yeah, no thanks. Oh my god. Oh, you know what? Here, that's a good idea. Play the Tahoe video. For those that haven't seen it. Shit was cold up there. Oh, uh, what up, Cream? Welcome, welcome. I'm gonna play you guys a outdoor ride video. Source. We'll get the browser source. Oh man, my legs, my legs fucking killing me. My legs fucking killing. Me. Get my heart rate down, man. Whoa, 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 whoa. What up, Cream? You ride, bro? You one of us? So, boom. All right, so me and Physique just did this. Um, oh, shit, I need to do that, actually. It's just cycling with Doc Majarky. So me and Physique did this last weekend. The other, the famous... Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, here's a good video of it, Aggie. Famous Tahoe Loop, the Lake Loop. This is Peter Sagan's favorite route. But here, just watch the video, whatever. Don't listen to me. Oh, just wait, my jerky. This is the highest alpine lake in the country. This is Peter Sagan's favorite route in the world. And me and Suzy, we 
Oh hell no, that's all me too, Aggie. Don't worry, dude. We're gonna have a dope ass video. And yeah, get all the pictures you want, man. That's what it's about. That's what this ride is about. This ride is about taking your time and getting all the pictures and video footage you want. That's what I was doing. Oh dang, that'd be badass. Oh shit, what are you doing? That's what it's about, bro. Woo! And there was like this big ass group of like 15 riders from the Bay Area that I was flying by. They tried to hop on my wheel and I fucking dropped them. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, I, see, I haven't gotten into that yet, Heiss. I would like to, like, eventually get into that kind of stuff, but yeah, exactly. That's so time consuming. I'm just trying to go out for a good ride. Big ad, what up, baby? How you doing, Big Ad? Watching a video of my uh, Aho ride from this past weekend. Dude, the fucking water, oh my god, from the sky and the green trees are just the bluest green you've ever seen. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I want to get one of those drones that like follows you. Get like a cool aerial aerial footage of me going up a climb or something. But again, like all sorts of shit to carry on a bike ride. And I uh, went for a run. Yeah, the 360 count, that can go. Dude, this was the dopest running trail. Just along the lake the whole time. Yeah, those 360s are badass. It's a good uh, like five and a half mile run. Got Pazit back there getting some footage on his GoPro. Look at that, that's fucking beautiful, man. And then they had these really cool plaques all over the place, like different, like, different like Vista points. And I just happened to stop at the perfect one, not knowing at all what it said. So you'll see one pass right up here. The plaque on the wall. And I can stop at this next one, watch. Perfect. Slow mo. Climb the mountains and get their good tidings. John, you're goddamn right. Ah, oh, look at that. Bro, it was fucking, I bet it was cool. 40s, definitely. High 40s. So clear, Aggie. Yeah, I had to get a video of the Zeke with the backdrop. Yeah, thanks, Texas. 
Oh shit, the Zeke's here! The Zeke's here, baby! Get up here! Pull me, bro, pull me. I need a fucking... I need, a, I need some help right now, bro. Nine. <laughs> yeah, yeah, jeans. And his tennis shoes. Oh, nice! Good shit, Texas! First day on the bike, yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, so cool. Oh shit, there he goes, there goes physique. Climb past me. Climb past me. Yeah, it's just forestry up there, man. And then there's like a uh, famous uh, Le Mans loop that's out there too that Greg Le Mans used to go right out on train out all the time. Dude, I'm hurting something bad right now. Oh. Thanks for coming in and helping me out a little bit, man. That was really a huge help. No, the Zeke! Oh. oh, man. I don't think there's much hammering at this point. My legs. <laughs> Just fighting off them cramps. Yo, Carmelo, what's happening, man? Damn, beast! Yo, fucking beast, Carmelo. Shit. Oh, I'm still alive, RV. Yeah. Uh, that's a damn good run, Carmelo. I've never ran a run that far. Furthest I've run is a half marathon. Thanks, Presto. Oh my god. Like a third wind. These flats are killing me, man. I'm fading. I'm in negative town, big time right now. About to throw a big old party, welcome party, housewarming party, and pop in negative town. Um, 
My groin. Starting to bug me. Oh, right, right. I was like, holy fuck, bro. 18 mile run. Like. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Aggie. You got that right, bro. No way I could have done my big ass outdoor ride today like I was planning. <laughs> I think physique's having some dropouts or something. I feel like I'm just kind of noodling until I get to help. Oh, I need more water too. Yeah. Yo, physique, if you're listening, bro, I gotta, I gotta hop off and get some more water before I start out. I'm zero water bottles. <laughs> Thanks, RV. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Let's stop up at the top here. Now it starts to get a little downhill. Let's, I'm going to chill right here, Sean. If you want to keep going, I'll catch you. Maybe. Oh. Oh. Yeah, let's fucking go. She's good on water now. Fucking go. Just get her done. Oh god, that'd be horrible. Figures. Talking about. Oh god. Oh, damn, look at that. Hell yeah, bro. Look at the fucking progress, Carmelo. That's awesome. <laughs> he shit his pants. <laughs> now, I, uh, I got rid of all that. Oh, before the ride. Oh. <sighs> All right, let's fucking go. Got this little climb to the bridge. The top of the jungle. I 
got out. Wait, what? Wait, what? Where am I going? Oh, there's something to go up. I don't know what what's happening right now. What's happening right now? Oh wait, no, that's epic. It's not help. I don't know what the fuck. Yeah, totally, Carmelo. Totally, that's why I watch all sorts of other dudes streaming. <laughs> Love watching other people fucking smash King of the Mountain. And you'll see uh, Queen of the Mountain QOM for the women. So in fact, you'll see K slash QOM just to give both on my fucking legs. <laughs> Carmelo, don't, bro. <laughs> I get it, though. I get it, though, because there's, you know, dudes like Alan that are, you know, any guys that are stronger than me is who I look up to. You know what I mean? Like, I, I want their power. I get it. I get it. I appreciate that. That's humbling, man. I'm just a regular, regular-ass dude. Fell in love with cycling. Just likes to fucking challenge myself and kind of test myself. Oh, nice. Carmella, are you in the Discord, bro? Speaking of Discord. Are you in the Discord? I'll uh, put up the link real quick. Oh. oh, my God. Tired. Fucking tired. Thanks, RV. Oh. Something like 20 kilometers, man. I gotta be getting there soon. Oh, Trunks, what's up, baby? Long time no see. Trunks, how you doing, man? Always good to see you, bro. Look at that. Five months, man. Thank you so much. <laughs> nice. Welcome to the, what we like to call the shit show, Carmelo. Just, you know, we just talk bikes and all sorts of dumb shit, man. I hope it's like 12. Oh, yeah, 12 kilometers. Shit, what am I thinking? I think what I'm thinking is the, uh, wait, no. What's the whole road to Sky Route? Is that like 20 kilometers? I think that's what I'm thinking. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm not doing, I'm not doing four hours yet. Not happening, bro. So, I don't know, maybe sub 420? I don't know. <laughs> 420! I've given up on the time. For the time goal, I just want to finish this right now. I'm still going to, like, you know, give an okay effort up out. I'm not going to totally noodle it, but my fucking legs are done for right now. They're so cramped up on the quads. Uh. Yeah, out PR, sub 43. <laughs> hey, there's Sean. Come 
I thought. Dude, where are we going right now? I really want to be in the jungle right now, as much as I hate saying that. I so wish I was in the jungle right now. Oh, oh my god. Oh, look at that setup. That looks beautiful, RV. Yeah, look at that fit. Perfect. Perfect. Uh. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. I mean, you can see my heart rate at like 200 watts and 160, so that's pretty high. I'm fatigued. I mean, I did decent efforts up. Epic. Volcano is an okay effort. I'll see what the legs got in them for the out. Right now, they feel fucking dead. Saving that feather for sure. Trying to get up in that physique. There we go. Thank you, brother. Get there, man. Oh, my God. <laughs> Let's see. Oh. There he is. Look at him. Look at that beautiful Bianchi. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, man. The legs. Sound like such a bitch right now. Hurt no. Anybody want to come to my housewarming party in Negative Town? I 
Dang it. I think I already did Fuego Flash twice. Fuck, I don't even know, man. Yeah, it is. Oh. oh, my fucking legs, man. Oh, damn. You had to finish with the owl. That sucks. Ass is doing good. Ass is doing great, actually. I'm wearing my Lacole bibs. They're probably some of my most comfortable for long rides. Um. Oh, that's a great question. Very important question. What are you riding on, then? Like, do you have at least, like, Added shorts? Or are you still just going padlets, bro? Oh my god. Like, then my legs start, my quads start hurting so bad that I have to get out of the saddle and start pushing power, which smokes my legs even more. It's like the only way I can get rid of the pain. <laughs> yeah. Oh god. Dude, get rid of the owl! Fuck! I guess that is not even to like 13 kilometers left, man. I still got half. I still got oh. I don't even know if I want to climb out. That's it, Citrus. This route sucks. Hey, hey, one, two, three, four meters, though. Yeah, I just got a noodle, man. Got a noodle. Yeah, game changer for sure. I've been, I've been telling him that if he doesn't have padded shorts, he knows I've been telling him. Ryan, I uh, you want to you want an invite to my housewarming party in Negative Town, bro? I bought a house out there. I'm I'm living there right now. I mean, I've done it twice before Trunks, where I've called my wife and had her come pick me up because <laughs> I bonked on outdoor rides, but they were big rides. And I didn't eat or drink shit like the entire ride and I was like five miles from the house or less. Oh my legs. Welcome to the neighborhood. <laughs> uh, I got you, Trunks, I got you. Come to my house and we're party in negative town, bro. It's lit. <laughs> it's fucking lit. Oh my god. Yeah, I haven't used uh, chamois cream in a while. I was using it pretty religiously for a little bit because I had some chamois issues. But, uh, uh, stopped applying it before every ride. I haven't really had issues lately. Dude, I'm so glad I did not go out and do my planned outdoor ride. I'd have fucking bonked after like the second climb, probably.
Oh, that's where I'm staying is the timeshare in Negative Town. Okay, okay, I got you. I like it. I'm in the timeshare. Uh, anybody else want it? Fucking please. I, I want to leave Negative Town. I need to leave Negative Town. I need to go back to Positive Town. Uh, just get me on the goddamn climb. I'll go to Positive Town. I promise. <laughs> Tell me where Fresno is on that list. <laughs> well. smashing <laughs> uh, what is the worst city Gary Indiana yeah that that city is fucking horrible I've driven through there a couple times when I was a young kid and then we're like a uh, melon campus from or something <laughs> yeah fuck you fuck you Gary Bunch of inbreds. I mean, steel workers. Uh. Okay, I don't even think I'm gonna do 420. 430. Like 20, uh, 12 miles to go, guys. <laughs> yeah, he is. Fucking hates me right now. I'm dying, man. I'm dying. It's like I gotta pick up the power just to get rid of the pain. Yeah, 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 exactly. Exactly. They've already gone this far. Is that, is that Gary? Oh my god, my legs.
God. <laughs> Carmelo, hell yeah. Oh. <laughs> I love it, I love it. Yeah, because if you actually encourage people to like go out and be active, and they get healthy, and they start making better life choices. They live longer. Don't out, go out and eat fast food all the time. Who knows? I don't know. Well, butterfly effect. Oh, I'm trying, RV. Uh, I'm gonna get to this fucking Alp. Yeah, this Alp is really gonna feel like that too, Carmelo. Just because I'm so dead right now. Oh. This fucking route, man. Damn, Alan. Yeah, it finishes at the top. Well, yeah, I know. That's what it says, Jed. It's bullshit. Bullshit. So, technically, that is, if I were to go all out right now and give it everything I got, I could probably not put down a 1,300-watt sprint. Ugh. Technically. There is no fucking way I'm throwing down 1300 watts right now, I can tell you that. I feel like I'm sandbagging like a motherfucker right now, Alan. I feel like I'm just like... crawling right now. Pew! 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 pew. Ah, yeah! Yeah! Ah. You might have gotten me with like that first shot, Trey. Maybe. Uh, I'm sure at some point on this climb I will not give a fuck about those. Oh god damn it, Brian, don't you do that! <laughs> yeah, you guys see physique. Look at physique's name. <laughs> yeah, 
adjust the outlet. Oh! <laughs> Thanks, physique. Oh. <laughs> Look at him. Look at him. He's even descending like Slow Spoon, a fat ass. Oh. Oh, man. Oh, ow. Be good to me today. Be good to me today. Stop. <laughs> oh, 35 minute up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Doable. We got that. No big deal. Save the legs for the out, man. Blast area not clear. It's that protein shake. Come on, gravel, give me my advantage. Oh. I fucking love this song. I'll crawl on broken knees. Like, that's fucking determination, man. I will crawl on broken knees. Maybe one day you'll believe Oh man. Oh, 
Oh. Oh. oh yeah, that's uh that's when Zeke when Zeke fucking changed his name. <laughs> make me push myself so that slow spoon wouldn't beat me. <laughs> oh, what's this? I know who this is, but I do not have this as a playlist. Take like a five minute break before out. I just need a, a break. Need a fucking break. Come on, a little bit fresher. Almost there. We're almost there, guys. Oh, thank God. I'm at home on the Alp. Oh. Thanks, RV. All right, you guys ready to see a 30-minute out? All right, slow spoon. <laughs> I gotta take a break at the bottom. I need like five minutes just to get the legs a little bit fresher. Just the non-stop pressure on the pedals right now. Uh, we here, Alan, we here. I'm gonna take a, like a five minute break. Go to the bathroom and we'll knock out this climb. We'll go sub hour. <clears throat> oh, my fucking legs. I love this part coming up. You guys ready? You guys ready for it? this again real quick while I go take a piss. I gotta take a piss all of a sudden. Nice. And then after this video goes, we'll get it going. 
I just want to try and motivate some people. Oh shit. Come out here one day for this ride. We're doing it the last weekend of July. Oh god. I'm gonna piss so bad all of a sudden. Oh. All right, I feel pressure. I feel pressure. It won't last very long, but I feel it right now. Yeah, it's beautiful, Lady Serene. Beautiful, like the because you're so high up, the blue of the sky like comes out of the water. The green from the trees is reflected off, and it's just the it's the most beautiful color, man. And you just ride next to that the entire 70 miles. There's like there's like a 30 minute stretch where you're not right next to the lake. So many awesome like vista points to go check out. Now this is Lake Tahoe. Uh, it shares uh, California, Nevada. Feel your love to tonight. Body moving through the night. All right, let's get it. Feel way better. <laughs> oh, physique sporting that cock and balls kit. Do this whole thing out of the saddle. <laughs> I know we just played this, but such a good video. I love it. I love it.
Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I always wear a cap. Just to keep the sweat out of my eyes. Oh, yeah, yeah. There's a lot, Jet. A lot of elevation changes around it. Because you like, you go up a little bit, then you come down back to it. Dude, Brian, so uh, um, I was supposed to go to Inyo County today and go climb all the massive mountains out there. White Mountain, Onion Valley Road, Whitney Portal Road, and Horseshoe Meadows. I'm gonna go out there next weekend though. Try and do it. But yeah, where Mammoth is at, oh my god. Yeah, Eastern Sierra is beautiful. So me and Brian live on the western side of the Sierras. Same with the uh, bike beast. Spooky. But the eastern side of the Sierras has like the largest cluster of most difficult climbs in the country in California. They're all like right there. Oh hell yeah, Brian. Awesome. That's what I'm gonna do is go camp at one of the campsites at the bottom of White Mountain. Wake up, pack up camp in my car real quick, and then go do the climb. Oh god, what did I just do? Oh, I just messed up everything. Oh, nice. Hell yeah. <laughs> uh, so Google Maps, check out like uh, White Mountain, Onion Valley Road, or just like Bishop, California, Independence, California. Like right around there, man, Mount Whitney's just right there. So you can imagine how big the mountains are over there. Yeah, Mammoth's beautiful. I've only been there once. Yeah, Lone Pine, Big Pine, Bishop, Independence, all that shit. It's all beautiful. Mountain country. High desert. Like White Mountain starts in Death Valley. White Mountain's actually the second highest paved road. And if you actually went with a mountain bike, did the additional 20 miles or something after the paved road it's all dirt like mountain bike shit it's the highest rideable road in the country yeah 395 yep yeah so it sucks dude because it makes me drive all the way down to bakersfield through to hatchapi and then up to 395 to get there Unfortunately, there's not just like a, a pass that goes through except for Tioga Pass in Yosemite and the fucking speed limit's like 35 through there. So I think it's like a five hour drive for me. Four and a half. Yeah, dude, it's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Yep, that's the yeah, especially these ones. Massive ass mountains, man. Is he live right now? Zeke, you just go live? 
Got a noty. Got the notification. Ooh, testing. Oh, nice. <laughs> I'm over there watching him. Yeah, just a black ass screen. You were a stranger to I get this power up. From the other side. Ah, come on. Thanks, Anarthic. Ah, oh, cheers. Hydrator dog. Ah. Oh. Yeah, it's been black for 24 hours. Got two hands on the wheel and you can move my mind. Six miles to go. <laughs> That's how I'm looking at it. Smaller numbers. Small numbers. Ah.
Oh yeah, I'm gonna get 49 for sure. Nice. Uh, oh yeah, yep, it's all the Alp until the finish. Finish of the banner up there. I think we're supposed to finish at like 2200 meters or something. Wilson. <laughs> yeah, right, Siri. You're crazy, bro. You're crazy. Uh uh. I don't even know if I could do like 10 minutes out of the saddle right now. Oh, God damn you, Antarctic. Okay. Let's start it at 43. Thank you for the gains, Antarctic. You're good. You're good. Thank you for the gains. I appreciate you. Here we go. Five minutes. That's right. For content, baby. You know the deal, Narthic. I don't know if you were here, but I did vent top. Then two, uh, like a week ago or something. Did the whole thing out of the saddle. Stayed out of the saddle for 74 minutes. Oh. <sighs> yeah, I was dumb. Uh, here, do uh, exclamation bike. <laughs> yeah, you do, Ziri. Oh, fuck. There you go. Yeah. The fez wheel coming out of me. Okay, okay, okay. I touched the saddle for like a hair of a second. I lost my balance. Oh, nice. Hell yeah, hell yeah. You got a new one. Hell yeah. They're good bikes, man. Yeah, so I got that SL5. And then just slowly started upgrading drivetrain components and wheel set. <laughs> yeah. Oh no! There we go.
Like, this actually sucks. I'm super fatigued already. This is way harder. Oh, nice. Hell yeah. These hunts are badass. Ah. Oh yeah, this fucking redeem sucks. Ah. Everything hurts right now. Oh. oh, nice. Congrats on Arthic. Hell yeah. Hot. I'm out of the saddle. Shut up, LePage. Yeah, next time, Alan. Not happening this time, bro. Uh-uh. I was doing good at the halfway mark. I was right at it. This started getting tired, man. Legs started cramping up. The destroyer of worlds. Oh man, one more minute to go. Fuck, this sucks. That 74 minutes was way easier. Uh. get a stitch right here An Arctic. That fucking smoked me. Oh. That was a good redeem. Oh. oh, we're gonna make this one though, huh? Hey, power up, yo. Give me a power up. Give me a feather. Where is it? Give my power up. What? Now it's just moving with me. Yeah, gunship. Yeah, Carmelo. Good call. <laughs> That's true. Ah! Kneecap. Hold on. Ah. I vote XP as well, actually. My right kneecap. Ooh, there you go. I like that. That's a good idea. Jesus, I wonder how long that would take. How many XP do you need? Yeah, 
Yeah, I need a shit ton of XP for that. Massive fucking grind cramp. Oh. Woo. That's scary. I couldn't get <laughs> dick cramp almost. Couldn't get on clip quick enough. Sorry, physique. Uh. <laughs> Tank muscle. Because I stopped for a second. Ah, come on. Yeah, that sucked. Yeah. Thousand kilometers. Yep, fuck that. Never happening. Get it when I get it. We're going, Trey, we're going. <laughs> I banned me six, but I don't know where her close has been. He hasn't streamed at all. I don't know, I think he's in a, a little bit of a lull right now. I'll have to hit him up. Oh my god. Come on. I'm gonna be done with this, man. I know, goats. I'm saying the same thing, bro. Oh. Wait, goats doing the Uber? Oh. <laughs> You're crazy, goats. Just doing it voluntarily, huh? I'm doing this because I was told to. Where are you at right now? Did you just start it? Oh. 
Oh. Oh gosh. Got a ways to go. Shit, man. Have fun. I'm dying. I was feeling good on radio tower. Yeah, yeah, nice. Yeah, I pretty much switched from arrow to TT to gravel. Now I'm on the climbing setup, I think. Did I not switch? Did I switch, guys? Not some on the fucking gravel bike. What bike am I on? I'm on the goddamn gravel bike? I'm on that fucking gravel bike. Come on, man. I fucking told myself in my mind to switch. Oh, I'm such a fucking dummy, dude. God damn it. My fucking gravel bike. <laughs> oh my god. Guys, we're fucking popping, man. What the fuck? Oh, that's when Temple K went pop me. I'm on a goddamn gravel bike going up this fucker halfway. Ah! Oh! Where's that fucking clip of me on the goddamn TT bike? Ah, uh, what the shit, man. Ah! Uh. Yeah, that would have been hilarious. <laughs> Thanks, Brian. I'm on the goddamn gravel bike? <laughs> I'm on the fucking gravel bike? Come on, man. I fucking told myself in my mind to switch. <laughs> I even took that six minute break. Even took the six minute break at the bottom. I told myself to switch. A fucking gravel bike. Uh so good. Clipception. That would have been funny. Pops up that clip. That would have been really good. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Bro, I, I just forgot. And then, you know, you're not paying attention of it when you're fucking riding. I'm not looking at, let's see what kind of fucking bike I'm on right now. I feel like the VC right now. I feel like a bitch. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I like the VC. I'm a fan. Just needs to stay off Twitch. Yeah. Stick to YouTube, bro. Oh, nice. We'll be able to... Beast. Ah! Come on. Let's finish this fucker, man. Halfway.
What happened, Brian? What'd you do? What'd you do, champ? See if that other one pops up. Where's the other one? Popped up a minute, a little bit ago. Oh, I do love this clip. My little girl and my wife came in right at the time I was finishing my Everesting. Four more meters. You can do. <laughs> There's another ride that I did on like a fucking TT bike, man. Did like the whole thing. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, same headband. It's just worn off in the wash. Probably not these shorts. I actually got these bibs after that when I had that ass shaping issue. I went through like four or five kits on that fucking climb. That Everest. Try and go to Chime, bro. It is fucking exhausting, Sictorus. I'm so tired, bro. My legs are so smoked and cramped. <clears throat> oh my god. And then those efforts like really fucking smoke my legs. Almost better just to stay up and stay on it. Was I on the goddamn There it is. The whole time? Ben top, yo. <laughs> I just do that on my fucking TT bike that whole time? Like, how do you not notice you're on the TT bike? <laughs> oh, such a fucking idiot. <laughs> oh my god. Was I on the goddamn TT bike the whole time? Ugh. <laughs> I mean, fuck. I don't know, this whole thing's got me questioning my redeem. This whole thing's got me questioning my redeem. But I'm gonna keep it, I'm gonna keep it. You can do it, it's just gotta be planned, it's gotta be scheduled. Probably do it like, not even this week. Wait, hold on, it's Friday. I wouldn't even do it next week, I'd probably do it the week after. Uh, for Watopia, I think I have like one more in London and like one or two more in fucking uh, New York. Super small ones though. I just need to go knock them out. I just got off the route hunting kick. Oh. I should get 49, right? I should definitely get it on the drive. Oh, oh my fucking wrists. Holmes. Come on, come on. Save enough for that trenching, bro. 
God, that's gonna be horrible. It's gonna be so horrible. And once I do that shit, it's coming off. I think I put on there zero of one, same with the Everest thing. You'll only be able to redeem that once ever. And then it goes away forever. Ow, oh, dude, why do you save? Redeem shit, Marine, please. I mean, I have to do one before the end of the year. Dude, my knee is starting to bug me. Yeah, I definitely didn't do the four hour thing, Skip. Thank you, bro. I'm dying, bro. I'm dying. Yeah, it is. It is. Thank you. Shit's tough, man. Finishing with a fucking Alp. <laughs> Could you imagine racing this? Oh, fuck no. I'll be glad when this fucking badge is done. Give me my 49, man. I think Caleb Carl did it as a race because he's got the top five overall time for this badge. Like 325, three, sub I think I can do that. There's no way. <laughs> no way I do 420. <sighs> I don't even think I'm going to get 430. There's no way I get 430. 21 minutes? No way. A measly little 5k, no big deal. Ah, 
Mm. Gotta max my fan, man. My heart rate's not letting it blow fast enough. Oh, yeah. Ah. Thanks, Narex. Thanks, Aggie. Thanks, Alan. Oh, you know me, Alan. I'm not gonna noodle this whole thing, bro. I'm gonna challenge myself with anything I do usually. Four hours was a little ambitious. It's fucking Barney this. Uh, oh, I'm so glad I'm here at this long segment because that means I'm close. What up, Dan? How's your run, bro? Prepare yourselves for war. Ah. Oh, my God. Here you go, Carmelo. Goat Smile won the battle. Well done, Goats. I care.
Definitely not going to run after this. <laughs> So close, god damn it. Oh. If this is outdoors, I'd be hitting my wife up. Come pick me up. Oh, my quads. Thanks for the Yeah. Oh. Almost like the easier I spin, the more my knee hurts though. So this whole NBA thing, there's no way I'm throwing down a 1300 watt sprint at all right now. So like, I feel like it should slowly decrease the longer you ride. He's killing me Stop right now. Stop being a fucking pussy okay. and hey, start okay, being an Alan. asshole. Jesus, okay. Fucking kneecap, though. Right one. It's really hurt. We're getting there, though. There ain't no fucking way I'm not getting to the top.
Half K. What is that? Like a mile and a half? Oh. Yeah, I hate this last long one, but it is like a symbol that you're almost there. It's the last long one. It's the last long one, you know? That's how I look at it. Last big segment. That too, Nerex. I agree with that 100%. Especially right now. Right now, I hate this panel. Usually, I don't mind it. It is Carmelo. It's an exact replica data wise as far as like segments and everything. I can't do that mashing. There's no way. There's no way. I don't have that today. So done with this right now. I mean, I could do it. I'm just not gonna. <laughs> it would suck so bad. Especially like getting out of jungle, bro. Oh.
No, God, no. God, no, physique. I'm not doing it, bro. Having, like, some knee pain already, so I don't want to push it anymore. I appreciate that, though. I know, dude. Physique's the man. You guys don't already know. Can't already tell. The motherfucker's down as fuck. Oh. Uh -oh. oh. Fuck. Dude, my fucking butt cheeks are starting to cramp up. He is, man. The best of them. Physique, just so you know, you're one of the best dudes I've met, man. See, it's just like, we're just like family, bro. <laughs> That's what's awesome. It's like, as cool as they seem in these streams, they're even cooler fucking in real life. <sighs> like, Aggie, Tahoe is going to be so much fun, man. I swear, it's going to be so much fun. I got a couple of my earlier cycling buddies that are going to be joining us up there so we'll have a nice group of fucking just awesome dudes man awesome dudes that just love riding bikes with other people that love riding bikes just talking shit laughing the whole time except spoon <laughs> oh my fucking quads are on fire Like when you gotta take a shit, and the closer you get to the toilet, the more you gotta go. It's like the closer I get to the top, the more my shit starts hurting. What up, Jet? Welcome back. You made it to watch me die. <laughs> Oops. Stay out of the saddle, man. It hurts so bad to sit down. Oh, God, that'd be horrible. <laughs> I took a pretty gnarly one before the ride, so I should be good. Let's go, physique. Let's go, baby. 1K, man, 1K. Oh. 
<sighs> oh god, I would have shit my pants probably. Speaking of that, oh, okay, I cannot trust any more farts. Perfect timing. I almost sharded just now. Okay, where we are, y'all figure. Oh. Talking balls. Fuck. Okay, I gotta do this next segment out of the saddle, man. My fucking legs are killing me. They're so cramped up right now. Ah. That's <laughs> too far. Yeah, watch. Well, I'm not gonna catch him. Oh, there he is. Physique! Let's let people see your jersey. It's like cats, but it looks like cock and balls. Here we go. Look at him. Look at him. Look at the little cock and balls. Look at them. But they're like lambs or something. Oh, oh, I'm I'm surprised I trusted that one. Look at them. You can't unsee it now. They're like llamas or something. Oh. Thanks, Narex. <laughs> Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a llama. <sighs> yeah, when the fuck is it coming? Quads are cramping up big time. Uh. 
Stop being a fucking pussy and start being an asshole. Oh, my legs. Oh. Oh. I don't know what to do with my legs right now. Oh. Oh, yeah, already here. Oh, God. Thanks, Carmelo. Thanks, Brian. Oh, nope, no, nope, fucking done. Thanks, Alan, for the games. Team. I love you, but I kind of hate you right now. Oh, God. Oh. oh man, time to drink a fucking recovery drink and take a nap and try not to cramp the fuck up. <laughs> Alright, let's see who can raid. Thank you guys so much, man, for being here, for all the support. All you guys, I'm not going to call everybody's name. Thank you guys so much, man. I, I'm not doing this kind of a ride indoors Stop if I'm not being fucking, a fucking pussy and start streaming. Being an asshole. Okay, okay. Um, if you guys aren't hanging out, you know what I mean? I'm not doing this shit by myself, so thank you guys so much for... Oh, for being here. Let's go raid somebody. Oh my god, my legs are so done for. Yeah, we'll be back on, like, I don't even know when. Soon. Soon. Okay. Kilo's doing kudos. Kilo's kilometers for kiddos or whatever. Oh, go say hi to him. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna. Oh my god. Oh.